Hello everybody, TikTok here, hope all is well. Today I'm just making a quick video to show you how to turn Cortana off since they took that option away with their latest update, the anniversary update. And if you're anything like me, you don't want your computer listening to you all the times. So let's go ahead and get started. Oh, let me say one other thing. This video is for the pro or enterprise editions of Windows. It won't work with the home. So with that said, first thing you need to do is hit your Windows key and R, which will open up this box here, and then type in there gpedit.msc. Click OK, which will open up your group policy editor window. And then you want to come over here to administrative templates. Now you want to click on the little arrow, which will open up. And then come down here to Windows Components and do the same thing. Click on the arrow again. And then scroll through here until you find the search file. And then go ahead and click on search. And that'll open this up over here. Now you're going to want to look through here and look for Allow Cortana. Once you find that, go ahead and double click on that. And then you want to go ahead and click Disable and click OK. Go ahead and close that out. Now you'll notice nothing happens. That's because you need to restart your computer. So I'm going to go ahead and restart and I will be right back. And voila, I'm back with the magic of editing. But anyhow, you'll notice down here there is no little microphone icon anymore. That's because Cortana is now turned off and not listening to your every word anymore. And I'll just open this up, go ahead and show you down here. You want to open Cortana up. When you do open it up, you'll notice it asks you to type. It doesn't ask you to speak. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, you know what to do. If you disliked it, you know also what to do. Uh, go ahead and leave me any comments or questions you have. And have yourself a good day. Thanks for watching.